And I think you've written about the fact that uh, very soon after the war began, people started to realise its, its historical significance, started to realise that it was different. Yes. People, I think, looked back in, in Europe, um, people looked back to the last major turning point in European history, which was the French Revolution and the Napoleonic Wars. And the peace of 1815, in a sense, with some alterations, the unification of Germany and Italy, was the peace that straddled the century subsequently. So in 1914, people had the sense that they were living in historic times, epic times. And how is that manifested? It's manifested um, in an outpouring of instant histories. The newspapers, we have the mass press in 1914, so the Times, uh, newspapers in France and Germany produce instant histories, week by week, month by month, um, histories saying the, the history of the Great War, the history of the European War, as they call it um, already. It's reflected in children's comics, um, in the language and the writings of ordinary soldiers going off to war. They say, this has been brewing for, for, for decades, we have to settle it once and for all people are aware that suddenly the world is up for remaking in the, in the summer of 1914.